Are you serious? Watch out, watch out, watch out. He's okay. Is that so much fun? What are you doing? You're helping Grandma? Yeah. What are you making? Okie folks, it is Thursday morning. I didn't vlog at all yesterday. I don't think I picked up the camera at all yesterday, which is fine. We were just hanging out, having a good time together. Um, and we're about to open up Christmas presents. Mom is making pancakes, which you saw that. Jacob was making pancakes with her in the kitchen. But we're gonna open up Christmas presents because Mom's gonna be able to save some money and not have to send them. Yeah, the Marshall. Yeah, he may have gotten a hold of the Paw Patrol present. <laughs> yeah. He, yeah. he told me what was in it, but he didn't. He barely opened it. But he was like, "There's something in it." <laughs> it was funny. It's, it's egg. An egg? Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I think I've zoomed in a little bit. Let me unzoom this. So yeah, we're just hanging out this morning, and then we're gonna open up Christmas present here here in a little bit. And then later this afternoon, we're going to my nephew's birthday party. Um, Aiden is turning five, and so we're going to go over there for his birthday party later. So I'm walking over to the cabin. This is my mom and dad's parents' house, obviously. And then my mom has this little cabin that my brother built for him and his wife, and they don't live here anymore. So she has turned this little cabin out here into a midwifery like it's her it's her cabin okay here's what it looks like got a little kitchen over here here's the front door so got the kitchen over here the bathroom over there where that door's open I'll take you over there in a minute like I said my brother built this little cabin for him and his wife and now my mom uses it for births which is great. She was just showing me this sign. Look at how cute. Life is best born in a cabin. I love it. Now I'll take you back here. She's had that picture for as long as I can remember and it goes perfect in here. I love that. I've had it longer than you've been alive. Yeah. Melissa I can... Otterbacher Hendricks. She was yeah. Otterbacher then. But now she's Hendrix. She gave that to me many years ago. I can clearly remember seeing it up on the walls growing up. Different places. Then here's where the action 
happens. <laughs> Actually, it may happen out there too, because <laughs> the pool is so cool. And that isn't even close to all the babies she's birthed, mm -hmm. delivered, not birthed, delivered. I love it. <laughs> oh, I love it. So, um, if you're ever in need of a midwife, I know a girl. Just saying. Like I said, she's got this cabin here. And it's not like an actual medical facility or anything like that. But um, lots of people love to come here giving birth because it's so much more comfortable than... Well, sometimes they, they like to be here even better than their homes. And so, um, it's great because they can come here and they're relaxed and then... They can stay the night here and go home um, whenever they're ready. So I think it's great. So I just wanted to, to throw that in there. Um, we were just talking and <laughs> she keeps saying something. I'm like, oh yeah, I need to say that. So she has a lot of Amish clients and Mennonites. And so Amish don't have electricity. And so if you have a birth at night, um, having it here makes it so much easier. And then you have air conditioning here and heat. And Mennonites have like gobs and gobs and gobs of children. <laughs> so coming here, you have the quiet. And I just think this is great having it over here. Um, and then it's just so cozy and, you know, homey. Um, so anyway, just throwing that in there too. What is it? You know, it's a surprise. It's a surprise? Hey. It's not an egg, silly. It looks like an egg. It does. It's not an egg. It's for Blakey. It's a little caterpillar. Tear it open. You can just go ahead, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Turn it around. <laughs> Turn it around. It's a, it's a blues clues. It's a hook. It's a hook. <sighs> it's a me. It's a It's a blues clues. Watch. We'll open it. Okay. Let's let's open all our presents and then we'll open them. This up. is for Dad. What could it be? What could it be? What could it be? <laughs> it's for me. It's for me. It's ammo. <laughs> Yay! I told you I wanted a Bible case. This was on my wish list. Yes. What did you pull it out? What is it? So cute. 
You just need your boots now. <laughs> Jakey, hurry up, open it. Tear it up, go fast. guys it is Saturday morning we're traveling home from Kentucky now the boys are having a ball over here what the boys are jumping on the beds right now so that's that's what you hear in the background I'm sorry they're pretty rambunctious but we just got up um, we stopped here last night in Topeka Kansas and we are heading back home Last night was exhausting. It was such a long trip. We left my parents' house around noon, one-ish. And so we figured we would make our way all the way to Topeka um, last night and then finish the trip today. And it was exhausting. <laughs> it was so exhausting. We got here about 9.30, I think, last night, somewhere around there. And I just went and got breakfast with the boys now we're all up um, getting ready to leave. The boys were so ready to be out of the car yesterday. I'm telling you, it was truly exhausting. Blake was done. He was like ready to be out. And so we're on the home stretch now. We only have about, what, six and a half hours to go? Uh, seven and a half hours still left to go. But we'll make it home. Anyway, I think I'm just going to end this vlog here, um, and so that way I can edit and stuff while we're on the trip. Hopefully, we'll see what actually happens, but that's what I would like to do, is edit this vlog while we're traveling down the road. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Remember to love God. Jacob's crying. Gotta go get him. Remember to love God and to love each other, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.